James Beard Awards are wrapping up for another year. And Chicago did get a big win tonight. WGN's Brona Tumulty has been on the red carpet all day and joins us with the details tonight. Hi, Brona. Good evening, guys. It's been such a lovely day here. Chicago had four nominees in the running, and we did get that win, at least one win. We'll tell you which one in just a second. But we had hundreds of people walking the red carpet, and Chicago even served up some sunshine as well. There was a rolling out of the red carpet today outside the Lyric Opera as the James Beard Awards got underway. I think this is our 33rd James Beard Awards. Uh, and I have to say, actually, it's my 17th. I've been at the foundation for 17 years, so it's, uh, it's nice to see that the way this has progressed. The glittering event has been on the go since 91. Their mission to recognize exceptional talent and achievement in the industry. It's such a phenomenal food town. Um, Chicago represents very strongly every year. And Chicago, known for its diverse culinary scene, had four nominees hoping to take home a win. Amongst them, Sujan Sarkar of Indian Restaurant. I think all of us are winner. I know we are in final. I mean, I can ask more than that. I know we have our wins. That's it. It's not a problem. Both he and Jenner Tomaska of Esme in the running for best chef. I'm just very thankful to have a, a fantastic team. Uh, a win tonight would be theirs and not mine. Anna Posey of Elska was in the category for best pastry chef, while Lula Cafe in Logan Square was also named in the category for outstanding hospitality. I'm super proud to be here as a Chicago restaurant in Chicago. Um, being recognized for the spirit of welcoming and care and kindness that we have. I mean, not only in my restaurant, but in the city. Um, super proud. And there were undoubtedly some familiar faces presenting some of the awards tonight as well. Not only is this the best city in the world, it's always nice um, to, be, uh, to be asked. It's an honor. Now, I did mention we got a win. Unfortunately, tonight was not the night for our three nominated chefs. Commiserations to them. But Lula Cafe did get the award for outstanding hospitality. So uh, from everybody at WGN, a massive congratulations to all in Logan Square. Well, I have the lyric, Brona Tumulty, WGN News. Thank you, Brona.